Hello to my YouTube family. Welcome back to the ShopFit tutorial. I'm your host Faisal Mahmood from Faisal Conducts YouTube channel. So before starting this tutorial, I will request you to please subscribe my YouTube channel and give me a thumbs up on my YouTube videos. And so in this tutorial session, I'm going to show you how you guys can hide vendor on your per pages. So let me enable a new theme. This is a new theme I have enabled. Let me take a look on preview. So this is the uh, new theme. I have just published it and now you can see it's totally empty. And if I used to open the per page, on per page here you can see this is the partner's demo. And title of product and that is the price. So many of the customers require to hide this vendor. So how you guys can hide this, let me show you. To hide this, you simply need to click on customize. It will take some uh, some moments to load. Yeah, so customizer has loaded successfully. Now I'll click on any of my product. And then here you guys can see on the left side bar, these are the product information, text, title, price, variant pickle, etc, etc. Whatever block you want to hide, you simply need to click on that eye sample. And that uh, vendor or whatever text will be included inside this will be hidden. Here you guys can see vendor. Nothing else. So this was a vendor. We have hidden that successfully. Now if I will click on save. And it will take a moment. Yeah, now it has saved successfully. Now let me refresh the preview. And here you guys can see vendor has been hidden successfully. So that is how you guys can hide vendor on your Shopify Dawn theme and any other 2.0 uh, Shopify theme having that feature. If not, then you read the documentation. Moreover, let me show you one another idea. I just recently built for one of my client uh, one month ago, I think so. See yeah, a vintage. So this is another idea. I just build. Let me show you. This is a layout like Windows 95. Here you can see this is a layout like Windows 95. My internet speed is a bit slow. That's why it's taking so long. It's one page uh, Shopify store. You can say if you click on shop, a window opens. It shows all the products. And if you click on any product add to cart. It will add per to the card and on the right side you will be able to see the side of card and here you will be able to check out. So let's do it again. See, it's working perfectly. You will click on check out and that's it. Moreover, if you go back, you can uh, read their story or about this content from here. And if you want to send them any inform uh, if you want to contact them using contact form, you can click on send mail. It will load another window. Having the contact form options, you can fill up these form options and it will send all the details to the store owner. Moreover, same things can be accessed from here. You guys can access these same things from here. So that is it for today. And I hope you guys will love the tutorial and I will try my best to keep uploading new tutorials. And I'm really sorry for the delay uh, because I was so busy in my some more projects and uh, it's so hard for me to find some time. But I would love to share the knowledge, whatever knowledge I have. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye-bye.